so next when coming to data types data types of plsql data types of plsql so under plsql data types every sql type is valid so in data types of sql what are the types we have discussed like character where care to number float integer large objects row id and so these things we have discussed in sql so all those data types are valid in plsql also so apart from all those sql data types it also supports two more data types what are the types here one is percentage type percentage type and percentage row type variable so these are the especially new types in plsql so why for this i will explain row type percentage row type so percentage type is going to declare a variable which is same as the column type which is available in a table suppose i may say like this m1 m1 for m1 i am declaring a variable called m1 so m1 i am going to declare like this std dot and s1 percentage type what it is going to do it is going plsql going plsql is going to declare m1 whose data type is same as what s1 type so s1 is a column of std table okay that means percentage type is going to specify is going to give data type of a column now m1 is declared as declared same as s1 type what is s1 here s1 is available in std dot or you can write like this also m1 suppose std is available in uh, our ksk schema ksk dot std dot s1 percentage type like this also you can write suppose here our std table contains id name uh, s1 s2 total like this like this I have many columns in std table id is there name is there s1 is there s2 is there total is there and average is there now if i want to declare all columns like this id name s1 s2 total average i have to take how many percentage type variables here 1 2 3 4 5 6 okay so instead of declaring all these individual types simply i can say like this std rec what ksk ksk is a schema name ksk dot std percentage row type simply i can say like this so percentage row type means std rec includes what all columns id name s1 s2 total and average so this is a better way when compared to this one that means instead of declaring variables individually i can club as a group std rec ksk dot std dot percentage row type now from std rec i can accept i can uh, get all the columns by using dot notation dot operator like std rec dot id std rec dot name std rec dot s1 std rec dot s2 std rec dot total std rec dot average so like this i can make use of std rec for group of columns okay so what is the advantage of percentage type and percentage row type the advantage of percentage type and percentage row type are even i don't know the exact data types of the columns original columns original table columns i can make a i can declare a variable like this okay that is the first advantage first advantage is when i don't suppose id is character type for this i want to declare a corresponding variable in, in my plsql block okay so to declare a corresponding variable in plsql block okay i have to declare a variable mid mid of character type so in some cases i don't know the data type of id so in such case i can make use of percentage type that means in case when you don't know the exact data type of table columns i can make use of percentage type and this is the one advantage the second advantage is suppose character type is previously it was 10 characters and in the future i may change width to 15 characters i may change width to 15 characters now according to the changes the m1 or the variables also be changed suppose here s1 width is here previously it was 2 now i am changing it to 3 now what happens there m1 becomes 
3 automatically according to s1 the m1 will, the m1 will also be changed okay first advantage is what when you don't know exact types of column table columns and second one is in the future you may change data types and sizes according to that according to that requirement the variables are changed so these are the advantages of percentage type and percentage row type